Hello, what's up? I'm Brian here doing another video for you guys, and this time I'm going to talk about an upgrade kit. What? That's something different. I don't normally talk about upgrade kits. Now, the reason why I don't normally talk about them is not because I hate them, it's because usually I don't buy them because usually I spend my money on the next figure rather than upgrading a figure that I already have. Take for example, Studio Series Ironhide has this amazing upgrade kit, and I could spend my money on that, or I could try and get the Kingdom Air Razor, and usually I try to do that. Also, sometimes the tone of plastic for some of the filler kits and stuff uh, is different than the actual figure itself, and that's not really the fault of the upgrade kit itself. It's just a personal thing that kind of grabs my attention, and uh, I don't know, I just feel a little off about that. But I really want this, and there's a major reason why I want this. Now, Studio Series Grimlock is one of my favorite figures as of recent. I just absolutely love it, but one of the things I hate about it is the wheelie. And what's cool about this upgrade kit is you pretty much get an entire figure out of this because it replaces that piece of trash figure that you get out of this. Anyways, this is pretty much the most of uh, the majority of the setup with everything attached and it does look pretty cool. And uh, I just realized that you can actually store the weapon on the side. I didn't even realize that till just now. But uh, this is pretty much what you get from the set. So you get the filler setup, you get replacement arms for the dinosaur, you get the sword, uh, you get these clear parts for the neck, and you get a replacement for Wheelie. But uh, taking a look at uh, the highlights, you can see the sword, which I feel like could have been a little bit bigger, but I'm not complaining. I don't necessarily mind. Uh, you do get the filler setup for the arms, which is nice. And uh, you do have some paint applications in that too that kind of blends with the rest of the toy, so I do like that. You also do have these filler parts for the feet. Now, I didn't really complain about the feet, but that's not too bad that you get those set up. Um, and uh, there's the upgrade kit for the dinosaur, so you do have the replacement claws with, uh, I think that's some articulation on the, uh, the rotational joint, or either they're just like this. Um, also, you do have moving claws, it seems, so that's pretty cool. You do have this transparent setup that goes around the neck, and I'm not sure how to feel about that because it doesn't really go with the rest of the gold, but that's going to be more of a personal thing that some people are going to be interested in. And uh, again, it does show the filler parts on the arms uh, attached to the legs for the dinosaur, and that's totally fine. Uh, Taking a look at Wheelie himself. Now, this is the big thing. You can see the comparison with the original Wheelie compared to the new one, and he does look really cool. I love the wheels on the side of the arms. I think that's nice. Now, the alt mode, which I feel like they didn't really need to do uh, a full transform uh, transformative uh, wheelie figure if they wanted to. They could just replace the legs, but they did it anyways. Uh, the alt mode definitely is very simplified, but I don't necessarily mind it. And uh, the robot itself does look pretty cool. I like how they positioned him like the original wheelie toy. But, uh, man, all he needed was knees for me, and it would have been fine, but uh, I, I like the deep orange on this figure. But he can still use the slingshot, which is pretty cool. And uh, let's take a look at the other image. You can see some more poses, and you could also see that you could swamp up the heads and open the canopy, so that's pretty cool. Again, out of all the upgrade kits, this one has my attention. I'm not sure if I'm going to get it, but I kind of want it. So with that out of the way, what do you guys think? Please comment below, let me know. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, to all those fun dudes, and we'll see you guys next time.